Hi everyone, this is Wynn from Portland Taiko, and this video is about acquiring or creating bachi uh, taiko drumsticks. So you're still able to purchase sticks online through two companies, Miyamoto and Asano, and I'll put links down below. But I also understand that that might not be possible for everyone's situation. So I started looking around my house just to see what people might have readily available. Uh, and I came up with some ideas for taiko sticks, again, not for performance, but just for practicing at home. Now, ideally, we would be emulating the dimensions of an average drumstick or bachi. So around 16 and a half inches long, and then maybe, you know, three quarters of an inch to seven eighths of an inch in diameter. Uh, but I think we should be flexible and just looking for materials around the house. Um, I just grabbed a bunch of paper, rolled it up, taped it. That seems to be like a nice little shimebachi. This is kind of a more robust rolling of paper um, and could be useful for something. Uh, cardboard and then taped up and then I think the most successful one is a grocery bag, uh, again rolled up and then taped, uh, which seems to emulate the dimensions best. So I'm going to walk you through that uh, with a grocery bag then, scissors, and tape. So with whatever grocery bag you have at home, just make a cut down the length of it. then along the bottom. Okay, so now that I have all of those materials rolled up and taped, this is the paper. And up for like a good small shimebachi, uh, a more robust, big set of paper bachi, cardboard. Kind of like that sound. Um, if you're using cardboard, I kind of. Um, smashed up the end so that there are no sharp points to damage the drum or uh, whatever your drumming surface is. But again, these are just for practice and, um, you know, my son tried out this one and, you know, kind of broke it. So, well, you know, these are not uh, perfect, but here are our grocery bag bachi. And this grocery bag was a little bit longer and feels like a bachi. So all of these are different possibilities for practicing at home. So thanks again for watching and there are lots of creative people out there. So uh, please let me know what kind of bachi you made uh, and what materials you found to create uh, your sticks for taiko at home. Thanks again.